Good day, everyone. I'd like for all of you to listen as I discuss my personal development. Um, first, I'm going to introduce myself. Um, my name is Bernardino Kenne, and I am currently 17 years old. Um, I want to pursue a career in medicine, specifically neurology in the future. As I am curious about how the human brain works, um, how it actually works, in theory, leading to discovery. So it's the for me it is the it's like the core of science. Starting my personal development plan with my goals. Um first I want to become a neurologist again so also so also I can achieve my dreams of sustaining my life for the future. I dreamt of this for so long. That's why I want to work hard for this goal in my life. Um, I, um, to achieve my goals, of course, I need to do things like stop being lazy and encourage myself to do school works. Um, it, it's need, of course, it's needed so I can have a drive to do my school works and eventually lead to my, to reaching my goals. Um, as, of course, laziness stops not only me but everyone from being competent. It basically blocks us from comp from reaching our full potential and competence. Uh, uh, so also, uh, a part of my personal development plan, of course, um, the goal, um, I have a goal of of desiring to have good grades this academic year. As having good grades will opt for good university choices in the future. And if I if I do ever get to those universities, then I might be the luckiest. I might one of I might be one of the luckiest students there are. Of course, I need to further develop my skills, as it is also part of one's personal development plan. I need to develop my skills and characteristics as an as an individual through emotional and mental management, and of course. Not forgetting to study, as studying will help me know more and perform well. Um, because I still lack attributes that will allow me to become a professional. As in the competitive market or in the competitive world, um, being a professional needs a lot of time, a lot of preparation, and of course, competence that will that will surface the standards and needs of the companies. So what's really important for me is to have a job and do ex extensive theories and research about the human brain. As I said, as I stated earlier, I am quite fond of the human brain on how it, how it uh, performs, how it reacts to, stimu to stimuli it gets in contact with. Um, I also want to have a book collection in my house because I love reading comics and science books as, as per my entertainment. But my top priority is landing myself a work or a job that will support my family, even my friends if needed, and myself, of course, in the future. Of course, without rewards or surprises, we're going to give ourselves one would, one would have less uh, encouragement to do their goals. So they may even fail their goals if they're not inspired. So a way for inspiring yourself is to give yourself rewards. And so for for another reward, I will treat myself to traveling to different places. Because I want to see the world as for myself. I want to discover many things. Because um, I, as I said earlier, I love science and I want to know how, how the truth of the universe works. And by that, I and by that I first need to know the world around me. And of course, I will buy and read books. And as I said, as I said, as I said earlier, those things really entertain me because they give me information and context about things I don't know or I have no background about. 
and the and of course the the those stuff that I read or those things that I read give me peace, serenity, and calamity because I get to focus my mind on one thing. So my advantages that I have that will help me achieve my goals are. I check my online modules before classes, basically advanced reading, so I have further knowledge about my lessons, and I I will struggle less when dealing with such. And I also love math and science, as I am quite or fairly competent in such areas, not speaking in a boastful manner. I'm and I'm and because of that I'm really passionate about science ever since childhood as I'm wonder I I I find the things around me wonderful and how they work. Um basically it fascinates or in other words it fascinates me how our universe works as I said earlier. And of course and I um what what are goals if you won't take action? Um so um, at, an action I need or have to take is start studying my entrance exams because I want to enroll in a university to achieve my dream of to achieve my dream of becoming a professional someday. Basically, I am preparing myself for college, which is my entrance or the door to my future goals. Because, in other words, university is a medium that will help you achieve your goals in the future, in my opinion. But of course, there are things that hinder us from, from reaching our goals. So there should be things that we should stop doing or start changing. Um, for example, I frequently procrastinate as out of my out of laziness because and I also prioritize my entertainment first than than what's needed to be done like academic works. I I mostly waste my time for idle entertainment which closes the door of opportunities for my for the life I dream of which is which can be quite a pain. So recently I have oh. discovered that I can back myself up in terms of academics but to, to do that, of course, I need the help of my friends, family, and or the people around me. As, of course, uh, no, as to their help, um, I can prosper and develop the skills that I already have or already possess. Because because of their help, my skills will be developed for greater good. The door of opportunities for my for the life I dream of, which is, which can be quite a pain. So recently I have oh. discovered that I can back myself up in terms of academics, but to, to do that, of course, I need the help of my friends, family, and or the people around me. As, of course, uh, no, as to their help, um, I can prosper and develop the skills that I already have or already possess. Because because of their help, my skills will be developed for greater good. But uh, of course, I need to have school offers or grants so I can achieve the opportunities in the future which will help me achieve my goal faster. Um, like having the chance to... Um, um, uh, I have... I need the school grants, of course, to achieve my goals, like achieving a PhD in the future, which is the the dream of my many peers. As so, I often see them as my competitors as well, even though they are my peers. Of course, I need to be competent in that department as well. But the, but before I do that, I must wisely and effectively. Use my time to my advantage. Although there is uncertainty that follows, that follows that I may not reach my goals, I will push through and work hard to achieve them. To achieve my goals, as giving up is, is merely a choice or a choice I must not opt for. Um, so. 
So for my SWOT analysis, um, we will start first with my strength. The S or the, the S in the SWOT analysis. Starting with my strong points. My advantages or strong points are that I have competence in the core of medicine, which is biology. I'm in love with that subject ever since childhood, as I repeatedly said earlier. Not boasting, but I am a little bit of a fast learner when it comes to that field of science. I also read info about it to further prepare myself for college. Now, moving on to my weakness, they mostly root from my anxieties as, as a growing adolescent. As we all know, the journey to finding yourself can be treacherous, especially if you lose your path. Such weaknesses seen in my personal development plan are widely influenced by my peers and my environment. The third part of my SWOT analysis, which is the opportunity. My opportunities will elevate my strengths to my advantage. In other words, my opportunities will be the foundation of my strengths. And the last part of my SWOT analysis, which is the threats. The threats I have in my personal development plan are things that are quite difficult to manage or to control, if I must say so. These threats not only affect the progress of my goals, but my well-being as a whole, which can devastate me emotionally. Now, discussing the progress of my goals. I currently can only achieve minor accomplishments right now as I, I am still in the middle of develop of self-development and finding my path that will eventually lead to my goals. And last but not the least of my personal development plan, the backbone of my goals, the people who will, who will bridge the gap to my goals are, are those people in my proximity or around my environment their family, friends, and professors. But even with the helping hand of these people, if I do not involve myself in the process of developing developing my goals or adding to my improvement, such aims will be for naught. So everyone, thank you for watching and listening listening to my pers to my presentation of my personal development plan. Um, I hope you have the gist or the or the this idea of what I need to develop and who I am in person. So goodbye and thank you thank you again.